to you. <laughs> it's, <laughs> you turned it, you into it, it. It really was what it did to me because it turned me into somebody, honestly, that I haven't been in a long time. The first time I, I mentioned this in the, one of the earlier videos, I, um, but when it, I guess when I first started, my physique started changing. Somebody referenced my man boobs, and that like brought up yeah. everything that I used to go through. Yeah, you know, and I, that I had shut away. Like I, I complete 180 away from it, and it made the change and everything. But then when I heard it again, I was like, ah, oh, yeah, I forgot how bad that feels. You know, like it was emo it was degrading. Like. And, you know, I forget who even said it, but they were, you know, just being funny. Yeah. But it wasn't like, look at your fat man, yeah. you know, like, like <laughs> yeah, like, and everybody did. And even people at the gym have always been asking me, you know, like, oh, you know, what about fat jokes? I'm like, you know what? Like, I expect it. Bring it on, you know. It's all fun and games, but seriously, we're still going to prove a point here. Um, but it was, it was very emotionally <sighs> trying, you know. Um, it was hard to keep like stable you know as far as like a thought process you know like because i just didn't want to do anything it sucked yeah that's totally lost like all desire to do anything. absolutely hell like and i mean we don't hang out every day or anything like that i mean but we are friends you know what I'm saying? yeah good friends i can tell as a, from an outside source it was like like i said with a one word text and everything yeah the demeanor change it was like <laughs> and you were still like into the project you know but when we first started dude we were both weren't we we, we were, were just, going nuts yeah like, we would text call like, I, oh, man, like and I, we, thing, I was man. at home filming unnecessary stuff like yeah. i'd set it up and like go vacuum yeah. like for who wants to watch nobody wants to watch that yeah. oh man we were just like you know gung-ho about it man and then like you know i could i could just tell you that not exercising not getting that you know endorphin release or whatever it's just man, it's it, my body just started to shut down because I, i'm not have taken it yeah long, yeah i i wasn't i mean and it does, you know, there's study upon study upon study show that, you know, exercise increases brain activity and, you know, and, and it's simple. When you put good sources of energy in your body, your body operates at max capacity and that includes everything, you know, uh, brain function, organ function, all that good stuff. And I was given it zero yeah. and all of it stopped. I, I'm sure, I bet you I could have taken, we should have done this. I should have taken like an IQ test or something before we started. Yeah, that would and then, cool. well, I have, <laughs> Well, Sorry. Let's do one right now. <laughs> Blue. Matter of fact. No, just kidding. <laughs> I'll just pull one out. <laughs> I, uh, yeah, yeah, it's, it, uh, it took a toll, man. It, and it still has, and it's still going to take a toll. You know, I'm going to have to pay for the repercussions or I'm going to feel the repercussions of doing this for six months. Right. You know, it's not going to be like, wake up and ta-da, like, you know, here I'm skinny like, again. Unzip it. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, like, yeah. Oh, I ran the 5K. I'm done. You cross the finish line and it just like, Shit. just all, yeah. No, that's, that's not going to happen. It's going to suck. Yeah, but I think it's important, you know, for everybody to see and it's going to be, it's going to be fun for everybody else. Yeah. <laughs> it, yeah, it really will. They can watch me sweat like I constantly do now. I don't well, stop sweating. Also, you know, we're sitting outside in Georgia and it's <laughs> 6,000 percent humidity. I had a foot long meatball sub on the ride over here <laughs> on the ride over here meatball sweats. that's what it is it's uh, the marinara sweats Ooh, uh, best kind of sweat well not the best kind of sweats uh, up there no nah, it's not really up there either no anyway, those are bad sweats yeah those are pretty much bad sweats those are those are like kmart sweats <laughs> <laughs> uh luckily kmart's not in business anymore so we're good yeah are they done i don't think they're done but i think they're only in like idaho or something New Mexico, yeah, the good states. Sorry, um, sorry to any New Mexicans. Do you? What do you say? To somebody from New? Are they a New Mexican? Yeah, I would say New Mexican. Wouldn't you? I don't. I don't know. I probably wouldn't. Just wouldn't not to be offensive. Idahoan? Idahoans. Idahoans. Idahoish. I, I, I don't know. Anyway, so okay, so we're starting phase we're starting two. Phase two. Let's. Uh, what, what are you looking forward to? not being fat and lazy yes. uh no realistically not um not struggling day to day everything i do from waking up because i used to be up early you know in six to seven and i still may not have had a client until nine or ten but i'd be up have breakfast hang out with the dogs you know watch the news whatever the case may be like just be productive before I even was required to be productive, you know, but now it's like sleep until the last possible second. Yeah, Half the time, like, 
Stacy's gonna kill me, but like, you know, regularly miss skip like brushing my teeth and stuff just to like get out of the door because I slept so long. That was more important. You know, like let me get it set the record straight here. I brush my teeth, all right? Like no, <laughs> um, but no, like I mean little stuff like that. You know, I neglected a bunch and I'm looking forward to actually being who I was, truthfully, who I fought for so long to become, you know? Like yeah. um I'm looking forward to being able to work out again. <laughs> Not looking forward to how bad it's going to suck to do so, but I'm looking forward to the benefits that are guaranteed, you know, yeah. with with uh, with making a lifestyle change and, and working hard, man. That's all there is to it. The first few workouts are going to be awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Only for people watching it. I'm going to go insane. The first one, I'm going to, I know I'm going to do this. I don't, yeah. it's not smart, but I know I'm going to push like, right. Like I was used to doing, you know. I was know? about to say, I've, we saw it. I mean, I saw it from that one workout. That yeah. The, the, you know, the last one. And it was, I, I know that it's going to be nuts. That's what I'm saying. I know that first workout is going to feel so good, dude. You're going to get in there and just. And then I'm going to hurt for a week. I'm going to, I am. Yeah, it's and then hurt. it's going to be embarrassing. I'm going to rip my shirt off like I've got a six pack and then this thing's going to fall out. And then it's like, it's like, who brought a pumpkin? Like, it just, you know. Uh, I don't know who's ripping shirts off in the gym. Yeah, I don't know of any gym that's not uh, no, no, no. But either way, like yeah, it's I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna I'm gonna go bananas and then uh pay for it for a week. I'm gonna be so sore, it's ridiculous. Luckily, you know, I've got enough knowledge in again, food and, you know supplementation, which we'll talk on for a second. But um you know, as far as how to help recovery and things like that. Um but yeah, it's still going to suck. The first few workouts are going to be great, but they'll suck at the same time. It's, you know what? The same thing every client experiences when they start something new. I, I was you know? just about to say that. It's like that initial spark, you know, you're so, everybody's like, yeah, cool. Like, yeah. And I feel awesome. And it's going to be cool to watch you get over that because like, you're going to have to push yourself past that. And that's when you really start getting results. I mean. Yeah. Oh yeah, absolutely. It's, it's not that first two, three weeks or first month. You know what I mean? So it's going to be fun watching you. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Motivate yourself. It is. I mean, yeah. I, uh, no, look, you know what? It's cool. I think, I didn't even talk to you about this, but I'm going to do something at some point where I'd love to get all my clients together. Consider this an invitation, okay? So we're talking current and, and past clients. We'll just say for 2012. Um, so we're talking, I don't know, probably 65 people or so. Uh, I'd love to get them all together somewhere, a field or a park. <laughs> a field like we have fields and streams running through but uh somewhere we got enough and then have like i guess a little payback from clients because i don't make i don't make life easy on people you know like it's my job they don't you know essentially put you through a workout yeah uh so yeah you guys keep an eye out for that maybe uh maybe we'll be happy one day just know that what what goes around comes around. This is going to be like three different. <laughs> what goes around comes around goes around. Like, because I'm going to definitely get back at them. Oh, yeah. For, but it's like, I, I picture it like every, a big giant circle and then me in the middle and then clients just calling out random exercises and then we all do them. Throwing rocks. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no, that, okay. Yeah, like, no, like doing, you know, the, somebody will just scream out an exercise and then we'll all do it so that, you know, it's not just point and laugh at the fat like guy. Like a big group. Yeah, like a, a big boot camp. Matter of fact, anybody's welcome to come. We'll we'll figure those those details out and make it happen. Um, oh, great! I didn't realize any of that. Like how hard that was going to be on me while I was just saying it. It's going to really yeah, suck. Yeah, yeah. I'm like, yeah, man. We, you see how we're getting pumped already? It's like, ah. Uh. But that would be cool, though. I it mean, would. It been, really would. And I know my clients are really like, yeah, we're going to get him. Like, yeah. uh, but it anyway. So. I don't know. I'm. I feel like honestly, because we didn't we didn't have like some ridiculous plan when we started this. It wasn't like all right, this day we're you know we just rolled with it, which probably wasn't the best idea. What we we accomplished what we said to accomplish in, in the first phase, and I think I'm more excited now about this next phase because I feel like it's more it's less entertaining, more you know, yeah. inspirational, educational, all that stuff, motivational, right. you know, um, which is absolutely more important than watching you know i agree watching how me laying on the couch struggling with you know being depressed or whatever um so i, I think i'm definitely 
there's no doubt about it. I'm more pumped about this phase than the first phase, even like the project as a whole, you know, that's what we were excited about the first time. But now it's like this phase is coming on and uh, that's, it's got me. Yeah. I'm, I'm pumped about the second phase. You know, I'm pumped about like the outcome of it. And what, what <laughs> I'm people, definitely excited about the outcome of what it. What people are going to, you know, what people are going to learn throughout it all, myself included, man. You know what I mean? It's just like, it's one of those things we all checked it out. We all watched better have now it's kind of like this is this is kind of what it's all about yeah you know and I, there's gonna you know i've already anticipated people like hating on it i guess for lack of a better term hating on it like <laughs> all the haters haters <laughs> with a z like yeah, four z's yeah, yeah. uh no like you know people are like oh well he was he was fit before it was you know like shut up man yeah, like oh, come yeah. on the commitment though. like That's seriously yeah. you come and talk to me when you've not done anything for six months and you drop everything and commit to it because right. that's exactly what it takes every single one of my clients have done just that and this is why they're successful you know now, i'm going to do the exact same thing my clients do mm -hmm. i don't put them through something and do something different myself but it's like people people always want to hate because i not that i'm in the spotlight by any means but that's what you know they're je not jealous that's even worse to say um but they just want to find a reason to not like it you know i've had a couple people send me messages yeah. and like you know on facebook and, and youtube and stuff and they're like oh man this is, this is stupid well uh, women <laughs> women like no but, but i've had like more than one like girl or woman or whatever like well you're a guy you can do it faster and you know guys are like no it's not man that's such a big jock and i it's funny because i have female clients that have said that and i'll show or you know i'll show them the results from a man who's lost 15, 16 inches in a month and, you know, 20 pounds in a month. They're like, well, he's a guy. And then I'll turn around and boom, show him a woman who's lost almost his double in the same amount of time. Like, it's not. It's about commitment. And that's why this is so important, yeah. this phase. because, And that's why, honestly, why the 5K is going to happen tomorrow. We even uh, talked about that, I don't think. Did we? No, I don't know. I, my, I don't even. A 5K. He's running a 5K. <laughs> I'm slowly biking. <laughs> <laughs> slowly biking a 5K. Yeah. Um, we are filming a 5K there. Yeah, we, we could look so forward to that. We did. We talked about looking so looking forward to puking, but... Um, yeah, that's right. Speaking of... No. Yeah. I, uh, no, like it's, you know, the same it, results are results based on how hard you work for them, period. Not based on gender or age or anything like that, because I've got plenty of people who are 50 plus that have produced far better results than people in their 20s.